This is uh, my ZVS uh, flyback driver and high voltage arc circuit. Um, just going to give you an idea what my little setup here is. Uh, I run it on uh, 48 volts. Uh, I have uh, three batteries here. Uh, these are two uh, batteries out of an UPS or like 18 amp hour. This one over here is uh, out of my jet ski. Uh, I take out in the winter time. And then I got a uh, computer power supply over here that's uh, been modified. Uh, it just puts off 12 volts. Anyways, I connect all four of these devices in series and it gives me roughly about uh, 48 volts of electricity. Um, I then send the 48 volts over here. This is my uh, ZVS driver circuit. I'll uh, zoom in on it here. Um, there's the, the two diodes, the zeners, uh, the resistors, and uh, the uh, two uh, IRFP250 uh, power MOSFETs which are attached to a heat sink. You'll notice on the top here I've got two uh, 470 ohm resistors in series. Um, if you're going to run over 35 volts through this circuit you're going to want to connect two of those in series or you could just use a 1K resistor if you want but the 470 ohm resistors are too low for the high voltages and you'll end up blowing your zener diodes if you uh, don't use a high enough value. Okay, there's the capacitors there. And then goes over here. This is the uh, flyback transformer. Um, this is actually an extra large uh, flyback. Uh, it's actually used uh, in a uh, rear projection uh, television set so it's roughly about twice the size of a normal uh, flyback transformer. The nice thing about it is is I get a lot more power out of this. Uh, this circuit, the way I got it designed, I'm actually pushing uh, 48 volts in there and drawing roughly around uh, 13 to 14 amps. So I probably estimate that's going to be around 600 to 700 watts. So anyways, uh, there's my circuit. So let's get with some action here and I'll start showing you some arcs.